I hope people come to Indie Bio Demo Days to be surprised. We've done quite a number of agri-food companies that have been their first of its kind in the world. And today with Saris Waves, you're going to see the first of its kind application of a new sector called electroculture, where we think Saris Waves is the clear leader. This is Mr. Changhan Kim. He's chairman of the Organic Farmers Association in Korea. For three years, he's been quietly validating this device, the energy pump. Every two weeks, he harvests kale leaf that will become kale juice at a bar in Seoul. With the energy pan, the kale leaves are thicker and produce significantly more juice. He likes the pan because in three years, it has never needed maintenance. Winter cherry tomatoes typically lack sweetness due to low levels of sunlight. With the energy plant, Mr. Kim's winter cherry tomatoes approach summer sweetness level. Running on only 0.4 watts of solar power, the energy pump's effect stretches 50 meters in every direction, about two acres. This is Mr. Kim's organic rice field. In the foreground, the rice is heavy with grain, so it bends over. In the distance, where the rice field is more lemon-lime in color, it's beyond the range of energy pump. We are now on 30 produce farms in the region. The pond has provided consistent benefits across 25 crops. Root structures are more robust, yields are higher, but more important to these farmers is the search in the nutrient density of bioactive phytonutrient and flavor molecules. The cucumbers are sweeter, the strawberries have better texture, the lettuce is better for you. To understand what's happening, Shift from biology to physics for a moment. The ultra-low energy field created by the pump, like the radio waves from your cell phone, can go through buildings. The only substance that is affected by the weak fields is the water in the plants. Water molecules are like magnets with positive and negative force. The pump organizes the molecular structure of water then consider that plants are 80 to 95% water. For each device in the field, farmers have been earning 5,000 to 20,000 more of their produce. But the greatest financial impact we make may not be in plant agriculture, it's in animal agriculture. This is Dr. Jungmin Jerry Ho a professor at the Department of Animal Science and Biotechnology at Cheongnam National University. He's the leading scholar in Korea on chicken nutrition. Jerry has conducted two trials in hen houses with the energy pump on over 800 birds. The results showed significant growth increases while lowering stress and inflammation in the birds. Professor Jerry characterized the result as beyond any feed additive he'd ever tested. Sarah's Wave is now ready to commercialize around the world. We are eager to talk with growers on every continent. 